Hey there, home learning heroes. Welcome, welcome. We are at the end. We are doing the last home reader. That's week four for unit five, where am I? So let's finish this unit strong. We'll do our home reader together. We'll go through the words and see what we know and what the, what the book's really about. And then we'll read it again for fluency. <clears throat> so let's have a look and maybe you can help me with the front title here. I can see why. And look at this cover page. We're doing something a little different now. We've got a girl, she's got something in a bag, something that the little turtles really like to eat. Look at them, <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Let's look down here, the big letter A, cover it up, Dan Jones, and the big letter I for illustrator, Cayman Kwok. All right, we're gonna go through this book and you can help me. First, we'll start with the title page. Ready, you read, I can see why. I wonder what is she can see? Let's find out. Looking at page two, we have a dolphin. The dolphin looks a little spooked, like something's uh, very scary. Let's take a look. Why are the dolphins, next page, and splash in the water again, flying in the air? What do you think? That's a good time to make a prediction. I think there are sharks in the water. Are dolphins afraid of sharks? I don't know. Maybe they're people. Maybe there's some kind of monster. Let's find out. Oh, look, it was a shark. I was right. Okay, let's read. I can see why. Can you see why? Because there's a shark in the water. Look out, little dolphins. Okay. Now I see a picture of the front cover, two little turtles. They look pretty happy swimming along. We can read, why are the turtles swimming near me? So they're coming closer and closer. What do you think those turtles want? Did you see the front cover? I bet there's some food. Let's have a look. Ah, we can read. I can see why because she has the food and turtles love snacks. Look at them eat those things up. All right, moving on. Now we got two crabs. They look pretty happy. Let's read. Why are the crabs smiling at me? Smiling is a word we remember from our last story. What do you think? Any ideas? This is where you make your prediction. You say, I think, I think, hmm, what would make a crab smile? Maybe a bird. Maybe they see a funny bird. Oh, no, the crab got the toes of the girl. Oh, I can see why. Oh, dear, oh, dear. I bet that really hurts. Those pinchers are, they're really strong. And look, she's got some tears in her eyes. Owie! Ah, maybe she should give some food to the crabs so they'll be happy. Those mean crabs. All right, lots of content words. We'll read these together so we can be fluent readers. Ready? Dolphins, flying, air, turtles, swimming, near, crabs, smiling, oh dear. I like the end of that. Oh dear, oh dear. Okay, so you pause the video here and you run through all these words because you need to know them so we can read again. And that is the end of week four for level two. So let's go back to the beginning now. We'll read for fluency. When we do that, we're gonna have a stronger voice and we will use a little bit of our energy and some ups and downs and stuff. So you can follow along or you can turn off the volume and try all by yourself. Up to you. Ready? I can see why. I can see why. Authors, Dan Jones, illustrated by Cayman Kwok. Why are the dolphins flying in the air? I can see why. Why are the turtles swimming near me? I can see why. Why are the crabs smiling at me? I can see why, oh dear, oh dear.
Ta-da, the end. Hey, good job, good job. That is the end of unit five, which means come on back and we will look at unit six together. Until then, I'll see you around. Bye-bye.